If you don't think the sun is painful enough, this is what you wear. These are definitely like a vibe. Hey everyone, oh, welcome back to my channel. I don't actually know if my foundation matches my tan. Uh -oh. I do have a tan video coming up and I will be linking it up here for you to watch. It's the second day and my hands are starting to like show. Anyway, that is not what this video is about. Today is a video about sunglasses. I just wanted to show you my little sunglasses collection and this is not luxury. I'll just show you my favorites and how they look on and then that's it. That's the end of the video. That's It's that quick. It's that simple. Yay. First one, I got this from the Philippines in like a bazaar. The Philippines is known to have a lot of bazaars where people sell really, really affordable clothing and I used to go with my friends all the time. I love these. They're so bohemian. I haven't been wearing these a lot because they're not really my style anymore. I kind of want more edgy things. The next two, they're also from the Philippines. They're from a brand called Sunnies. And these are not super expensive, but in the Philippines, they are a little bit more pricey than, say, the bizarre ones. I got these because somebody was selling them for really cheap. So this is how this one looks like. It's really nice, but to be honest, it doesn't protect me at all from anything. I think this is more like a fashion thing more than anything else. This is another Sunny's one. It actually came with the orange ones. And this is like, if you want the sun to hurt your eyes... This is what you wear. If you don't think the sun is painful enough, this is what you wear. Right now, my light bulbs, my white light bulbs, look yellow and frighteningly bright. This is definitely a fashion thing. Also, like, probably an indoor sunny. I think these are for indoors. These are from Nine West. I actually got these at Winners. So I got them at a good deal. I do like them. They're like aviator style and much like the first one that I showed you from the bazaar these kind of have that same style but they're a little more squared off and they're like silverish so I'm a gold person I like gold things and this is a silver tone when I wear black or when I wear silver something that needs silver tones I tend to gravitate toward these sunnies and I love turtle tur turtle tur tur turquoise the next one i got is at winners from roots i really was attracted to the handle here i feel like it's very different and these are classic aviators i love these these are crooked whenever they're crooked i feel like my ears are the ones crooked and not the glasses i immediately think oh my gosh it's my ears these are one of my favorite aviator styles because of the color and the tone i like how big they are i generally like bigger glasses but yeah i like these so much now the last pair of aviators i got is from h&m these were my ultimate favorite for such a long time because of the gold the brown and the white those are my colors so these ones are definitely a vibe because of the white rim i love these for such a long time but it doesn't go with every outfit so i have to plan accordingly it is definitely like a vibe a style i have to be wearing a certain thing and feeling a certain way to rock these they definitely have a lot of character to them now we're moving away from aviators so this pair i got from h&m as well and you can see the turtle type of color i don't know why i'm showing it to you through the mic like you can't see it through the mic that's weird i definitely love the turtle color these were a vibe for a long time for me i think a couple years ago not so much anymore but i do love again i do love the turtle i think I don't know what the name of it is. Turtle, turtle oil, turtoise, turtle shell. I think it's called turtle shell. The turtle shell pattern is definitely my favorite. The next one my sister got for me from H&M as well. H&M has a lot of good sunnies and they're very well built. They're cheaper sometimes than the Amazon sunnies and definitely much cheaper than Zara ones. So these ones are very edgy. They're not for like every day or for the faint of heart. These are definitely like a vibe you can't just go around and like wear these and not feel yourself you have to feel it you have to be in the moment if you want to wear these and i like to set these a little bit lower where my nose is and not like not like this but like you know yeah again with a turtle type of pattern right there it's a little smaller than anything else and that's why i like to keep it a little bit lower than usual and i feel like a bad 
happy when I wear these. On to my last two. These are definitely my most worn and my favorite. They're actually the same shape, but one of them is from, I believe it's like Aeropostale. Aeropostale. I don't know how to pronounce the name. Aeropostale. Okay, there you have it. Aeropostale. I got these at Aeropostale. I feel like I'm saying it wrong still. And these are my absolute favorite pair right now because they look so edgy, but unlike these ones, they're much fatter or like longer. You don't have to be as brave to wear them like you need to do with these. These ones, I just feel like a bad boss. I, I love this one. I feel, I like to drive my boyfriend's truck and I like to feel myself when I would drive that truck. And I definitely do when I wear these shades. I like them because they're black and then they're sharp, but they're not like curved up and I recently made another purchase from H&M it was on sale and it's exactly the same one you can actually tell they're very very similar but the handles are a little bit different this is on the thicker side and this has the turtle pattern I wanted to get these on Amazon but they were 20 bucks versus the 15 I paid for these on H&M I wanted to get this pair from Zara but Zara sells their pairs at $80 like why? This definitely has more character and it's also more summery. I feel like this one is like holiday vibes. Like when I wear these, I feel like I'm on a holiday. And there you go. It was a short but sweet video. I just wanted to show you my favorite sunnies from places that are affordable. You don't have to go and spend $5,000 on a pair of sunnies. Unless you can, then definitely do that. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Comment down below what you'd like to see next and hit that like button as well. If you want to support me, please check out my videos here, 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 and here. And I hope to see you in my next one. Bye!